Hmm. I like it. The flaves. It's got soul. Soul of the South. How goes this? Brian, the national park, it's so special to this area, to my childhood, to my memory, and probably my earliest attachment of like smell and sound. Let me see that. It's back. <laughs> it's back. Uh, my, my best memory and clearest memory is proposing to my wife in the national park. <laughs> it's loose. <laughs> Down on one knee. How many years are you banging? Ten. Wow. Whoa. <laughs> Ten years this year. That's crazy. Well, we wanted to bring together some inspiration from things that we love. We love coffee. We love the national park. So we've been working on this blend to try and have the inspiration of the flavors of a coffee yeah. blend. Kind of that really herbal, earthy, salty, bush characteristics. And we've got an Indonesian and a Honduras coffee in this blend. Mm. And here it is here, just perking Bubbling away. away. <laughs> what do you reckon? We'll have a sip? Yeah, for sure, man. Yeah. Mo's deaf. So this blend is going to be available for the next four weeks in all of our White Horse Coffee stores. We are blessed to have such a beautiful place to escape the world, escape the hustle and bustle of our lives and just get to the bush and relax and listen to those beautiful tunes of nature. Totally. It's good. <laughs> it's a good, good blend. It's like sweet, toffee. It's got a little bit of like herbal note to it. It's mm. like it does have that wattle seed yeah. character. Yeah, wattle seed, sea salt. Just reminds me of camping and drinking coffee, but better. Soul of the South.